moral suffering of these families because these families have the right to know. The inevitable harsh reality of conflicts and the humanitarian crisis is that of casualties. They leave behind questions, sadness, and unidentified victims. The International Committee of the Red Cross and its forensic team use a forensic science to promote the best practice that address the humanitarian concerns and alleviate the sufferings of thousands of people affected by conflict. This isn't your typical CSI story, but this is the reality of a forensic work in the world's most challenging environment. Forensic experts using their expertise like DNA analysis and anthropology. Similar to those you have seen in CSI, but with a humanitarian focus. Their goal is to better enable forensic partitions and institutions to identify remains and uncover the identity of the deceased. The ICRC works hand-to-hand -hand with the national entities respecting each culture and local traditions worldwide to strengthen their forensic system and ensure state can live up to their obligation under the international law. As we dive deeper into the world of the forensic work at the ICRC, it becomes clear how essential is this role is in ensuring the respect of the disease and in providing answers and solace to families affected by conflict. Now, let's hear from the forensic expert at the ICRC. Dr. Oran, how are you today? Can you give us more insights about the forensic work in the ICRC? For me, uh, forensics in this type of work is really uh, applying it in compromise or challenging environments. Um, so what we will be doing is what you see on CSI, uh, for example. Uh, first and foremost, when we think about dealing with different uh, communities, it's about listening to people, helping to dispel myths, and seeing how communities can benefit from forensic science by ensuring it doesn't disregard people's beliefs and traditions. How this work is impacting the affected community? In terms of the impact that this has, Firstly, I think we have to recognize that too many people are denied access to forensic services. Whether that be the identification of family members, cause of death determination, or even certification of death, this uh, makes an incredibly important difference in people's lives in many, many different ways. Respect for the dead is common to the patchwork of cultures across the world. Access to forensic services to help ensure that happens is fundamental. By helping build the state's capacity to identify victims and better ensure the protection and the respect of the deceased, the ICRC brings solace to families, allowing them to mourn and honor their loved ones. This critical work helps to heal wounds and allows families to lay their loved ones to rest with dignity and peace. The ICRC's forensic work may often go unnoticed, but this is a powerful force to alleviate suffering, to prevent disappearance, and providing answers in the darkest of times.